from Georgia. Um, didn't play as much golf as we wanted to, but we uh, certainly had a great time, met a lot of great people. The, the Southern people are so friendly. It was just so enjoyable. Um, got a shout out for uh, for Bacon Golf Club. We went there, we, we had a chance to play a, a round of golf there. The only round of golf we ended up playing because of the rain. And the people are so friendly there, absolutely. We want to give a shout out to Julian with a G. Julian with a G, I hope you're watching this because you are a special person. You just greeted us with a big smile, say welcome all, yep. and we loved it, and we love you. We think you're a great person. You're a great person for, for Bacon Golf Club, and I hope they appreciate you, which I'm sure they do. All right, guys, I'd like to give a shout out to Wiley's Barbecue as well. Awesome place, great food, great service, great hospitality. If you guys are in the area, check them out. You definitely won't be disappointed. Now, we did do a couple of things that uh, we have more golf related. We went on a couple of uh, tours, one on a dolphin tour. We visited Harbor Links. We got a picture of the Beautiful. famous light tower where they play the Heritage Classics. We went into the clubhouse, saw the Pete Dye room. What a beautiful place. Beautiful. Unfortunately, we didn't play the course, but I'll tell you what, that's on our agenda. That's on my bucket list because yeah. it was absolutely beautiful. And again, the people there, so friendly. I tell you, when they talk about Southern personality or Southern hospitality, now I know what they're talking about because it was a great, great trip with great people everywhere. Yeah, I kind of, like I said, the trip was amazing. We had a good location too, the house was downtown, um, walking distance from everything. But we definitely had a good experience and uh, I would definitely go back. So we got these videos that are coming up. Um, we're not certain how we're going to do it because there's a lot of video. Mike is the expert at, at yeah. editing. He does all the editing. Well, he's the expert. He's, he, well, he's the expert. He, he's, he's, we're, hey, like everything else, we're learning as we go. Mike's been doing a great job at it. So right now we're going to be um, editing it. So we might have part one or two. We're not certain exactly how we're going to do it. But just keep in tune and um, hopefully we'll all be able to make an entertaining video and you all enjoy it. Thank you guys and make sure to please like and subscribe and have a great day. All right guys, on our way to uh, Georgia, as we said in the previous video, we're stopped here in Vadeville, North Carolina. We were in a lot of traffic. We were in a bunch of traffic. There was a four car accidents on the way down. So we were rerouted and so on and so forth. But we finally got to Fayetteville, North Carolina, and we're staying at the Days Inn. You can see we're in a pretty good spot here. We've got Burger King, we've got Waffle House across the street. McDonald's, uh, even a Taco Bell. So, uh, in down the street, we just came back from Ruby Tuesday. So, we're in a pretty good spot here. We hope to get up early tomorrow, start our trek down to Georgia, and start giving you some really good quality film. All right, guys, Frank from Pals Back Golf again. Um, gonna tell you a little story about finding some great deals down in Georgia and at Goodwill. But I got something on my mind right now. I'm doing this video, we're down in Georgia, it's hot, and we got a little rain, and I'm wearing a tank top. And I wear tank tops because it's hot. And my son Michael, who you've seen in the videos, told me I'm too old to wear a tank top. I said, what do you mean I'm too old to wear a tank top? He said, instead of wearing a tank top, you should be wearing a girdle. Now what do you guys think about that? Girdle. That's my kid telling me I should be wearing a girdle. Anyways. I had to get that off my chest. But beside the point, I want to show you some of the great deals that we got here. Now we'll start off with this um, Big Bertha FDI, FD, uh, FD3 I should say, Big Bertha 9 degree driver. It's got a graph, um, graphaloid stiff shaft, nice condition, feels very nice. That's deal number one. Deal number two is uh, a great Big Bertha Two, 10 degree driver, regular, sh regular shaft, very nice feel. Um, we got these at the same Goodwill. That's deal number two. Deal number three is uh, a Big Birth of Three Wood in excellent condition. I mean, absolutely excellent condition. It's got a great grip. It's got the RCH shaft. Feels very nice. That's deal number three. Deal number four is a Ping I 2 iron, the old Ping I 2 iron. Very nice, needs some work, needs a new grip, but a very nice collectible and it's, you know, Ping's got a great name. So that's deal number four. And deal number five is a beautiful set of Hogan Apex irons. Just missing the seven iron. These have got brand new grips on them, 
and they are in, I would say, excellent condition for their age. So, why is it such a great deal? Well, it's a great deal because we pay one dollar for each club. So we paid seven dollars for the irons, and we paid one dollar each for the Callaway drivers and the Ping two iron. These are great deals. We're down in Georgia, first day in Georgia. Boom, baby, we got it. So we're hoping now, you know, we're gonna have some fun down here. We're gonna play some golf. We're hoping to find some more deals, and uh, we're hoping to, uh, you know, have a more content in, uh, in our next video. But Keep in touch. Um, please look us up and like I say, please like and subscribe. Have a great day. All right, guys. Frank again doing another club test. Now, these are the clubs that we bought at the Goodwill for a dollar each. The uh, Fusion or uh, the Fusion Big Bertha 9 degree stiff shaft with a graphaloid prolon shaft. And then we got the Great Big Bertha 2 uh, 415 driver 10 degree loft with a regular shaft. Now, in addition to this being a stiff shaft, this is also 9 degree loft for the FD3. So this one's got the 9 degree loft stiff shaft. This one's got the 10 degree loft regular shaft. I'm going to start off with the regular shaft first because I think it'll be much easier for me to go. Yeah. That was a good one. Add a little left. Hit it good. Alright guys, I hit that one a little left. I felt like I hit a good, had a good feel to it. Let's try it again. Look at that stomach. That was a real good one. You're hitting that pretty good. Hit this one again. They're both, both ones I hit so far in play. Good solid hits. I kind of like them. All right, let's try it again. That's great. Another good one. Can't go wrong with that. All right, guys, that was the great big Bertha 2 10 degree driver, 415 head size, regular shaft. Hit everyone in play, hit them relatively long. So that, that's a good one. I'm, I'm happy with that one. Now we're going to the big Bertha Fusion 9 degree, a 9 degree loft stiff shaft. This should be more difficult for me to hit because I'm an old man. I got a slower swing speed. Probably not the right club for me, but let's see what happens. Come on, old man. Gotta swing a little. I feel like I gotta swing a little harder with this one, but I'm not going to. Stomach gets in the way. Maybe I'm not as old as I think. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, that wasn't so good. That was a slicer. All right. One good, one bad. Watch out. You got someone coming in and play, Dad. Stop it. Better cut it because there's a person walking in there in a range. But I'm going to do the third shot with the with the Fusion Cub. It says neutral loft. I mean neutral flat face. This is going to be yes or no here. This one is got a great feel to it. This one's got a good feel to it. The results were similar. Uh, I don't know which one I would choose. I'm gonna have to test them out a little bit further. But uh, right now, I like it. when I hit it. When I hit it right, I like the way the fusion feels. But uh, 
We're going to do some more testing on this in a future video because we got other clips to test as well. You guys have a great day.